What's going on? Uh, going to Fraser once again. This is probably the mo not the most ideal weather. A severe and unrelenting weather system. Wild storms are again smashing the southeast. And more than 300 millimetres of rain. But we're going to make the most of it anyway. See how it all goes and uh, yeah. Radio is day two on Fraser. Yesterday was uh, was pretty <laughs> weather-wise. Uh, we're getting absolutely rained on. That's why everything is all tied down and all like that. But today's looking a bit better. So Ben and I currently just got some brekkie on the go, a little bit bougie. But uh, what's the plans today, mate? I think we're gonna head up to Eli Creek. Hopefully the sun will stay out a little bit longer for us today and see how we go. Yeah, keep you updated. We got Chels, Chels and Jackie cooking up some lunch over here. What are they? Miniature snags. So, uh, snags for ants. Snacks, and then we're going to caramelise the onion with some butter and slap them on some bread. Oh, very nice, very nice. What we got over here? We got codes keeping out the sun. What we got over here, mate? Oh, nice, nice. Good day for that. Moving along, we got the boys here finding some stuff for lunch. Yes, sir. Loving it. Loving it. Over here, we got the power couple of Fraser. Trent's looking fed, Jim working <laughs> off in the new year. <laughs> well, what have we got over here, mate? Oh, mate, some hickory smoke, barbecue sausages, potato salad, cheese, <laughs> sriracha, aioli. Salad. You didn't cook that. It was you, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got a little, got a little. So we're currently down at Lake McKenzie and it's just clicked over lunchtime. So I thought I'd let the cat out of the bag. The uh, surprise with this 12 volt is we're not going in an oven this time. I've uh, invested in an air fryer. So me and Beebs are going to cook up some spring rolls and see how it all goes. We'll work like that. So a couple each, maybe like. Maybe a couple more. Pretty hungry. Right here, yeah, how about that? You know, whack it in here. We've got 200 degrees for 15 minutes. Yeah. So I got this air fry from BCF. So it draws roughly about 120 amps per hour. So with the 3000 watt lithium, I can I can run it pretty well. Also, I'm doing about a three hour drive, so with the alternator input, it should be pretty good. So we should see how this turns out in about 15 minutes. 15 minutes later. You can't tell me that looks appealing. Hey guys, look what I made. It's, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and there we go. Here we go. Big moment here. And there we go, air fried spring rolls at Lake McKenzie. Hot, hot, hot. <laughs> so we've just got to Lake McKenzie. Uh, and we've got everyone here, we're trying to take a break as usual. <laughs> the, sun has, the sun has popped its head out, which is really good. So it was an absolute mission this time of year. Um, to actually get a car spot, but we managed to get one after about 
13 hours, but it's all worth it when you got that. Oh yeah. It's pretty late in the oven now, just packing up at, uh, at the lake, gonna head back home. Maybe a cheeky little dip up at uh, Eli Creek. And then I reckon a few beers on the car tonight again. What do you reckon? Yeah. Westside tomorrow. Westside tomorrow. Get get excited. I'm bloody I'm bloody pumped. Sunset over on the west side. Cheese beers. board. Beers. Can we start up a bit? Righty oh. So we've just got back to uh you're wrong from Lake McKenzie and Baz had some electrical problems, not charging, so we're gonna well he's gonna try and jimmy up something. So what do you what's the plan mate? What's happened? My circuit breaker that runs the fuel battery system that feeds the BMS in the back, manager 30, has carked it. Um I'll just take you over and show you. So, circuit breaker here. It's got all covered with uh, grime and engine grease, and it's not resetting. So, I was getting from the battery, I was getting 14 volts on this side, but only four on this side while it was working, and then just playing with it. I've now that button's stuck in, it's not resetting. So, what I've done is just sort of Ghetto rigged a 80 amp fusible link with uh, some nut and bolts look on the. At that. Look at that! It's uh, a piece of work. not something I'm proud of. <laughs> not something I'm proud of, but it's day three and the fridges are flat because of it. So you need cold beer. Solar's solar's not keeping up. Yep. So well, just putting it back together now and hopefully I can get some engine charge in that last battery. Fingers crossed. Rightio, day four, uh, heading to the west side today, the bloody weather is looking so we're gonna pack up camp soon, head over, do a quick pit stop at Champagne Pools, maybe the pub, then head out to Wathumba Creek for the afternoon. There you go mate, play on. So at the moment we're just waiting to go to Champagne Pools and then we'll make our way up to Orchid Beach and Wadi and then I got it. I can no, vlog. No, I can no. vlog. Take my cereal bowl so this seems a little bit more serious. <laughs> um, and then yeah and then we're gonna make our way over to Thumba to end the day for a nice sunset and it's gonna be a really nice day. Just uh, pulled up at Champagne Pools, just walk on the pool board and look at that. Just at um, Orchid Beach, having a few skewies, a couple of chips, everyone. Been looking bloody good. Chippies. Take three mud mods and beers, Andy's stuck. I think a few more. 
be next to habit, Baz. Man. You need to be next to Baz. I got a little bit trigger happy. Yeah. So guys, as you can see, it's really soft here. Andy, what are your tires on, darling? 40 psi or something, yeah? Must be, eh? <laughs> oh, you, you must be new to this. You must be new to this scene. <laughs> no, that's fair though, getting other people to do your manual labor. <laughs> Hurry up, Trent, come on. Actually, no, you're bold, you do it. Yeah, we can hear you do it. <laughs> I'm out. We're having fun. This is what it's all about. I'm not copying that much. I'm copying a little bit. <laughs> well, we have finally made it to Wathumba Creek. Bit of a bit of a bogging situation going on. <laughs> got a bit trigger happy, but that's all right. That's nah. all right. But now we got shade, which is the main thing, and everyone's happy. <laughs> <laughs> we got so there, we're yeah. just gonna chill here for the rest of the day. Make some lunch, have beers, play some music, and just enjoy what you can see. What have we got, Trent? Oh, it's steak, burger, double egg, double bacon, triple cheese. Give us a look. Just need to look for the beer. Oh, oh, oh. Not bad at all. So we're uh, currently out of a Thumber Creek today. Uh, the sun has definitely <laughs> bloody popped through, and uh, we're just having a few few tinnies, mate. A few tinnies and uh, living the good life, pretty much. Got the boys over here playing a bit of spike ball. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone bit on the sun. Over there, where you reckon guys? What are you up to, mate? Um, not bad, mate. Like, yeah. Just getting burnt. <laughs> We're throwing the water. Stay in the water, Trent. <laughs> So it's uh, the last full day here at Fraser. Uh, a couple of the people left to go home early because they had work and all that sort of stuff. But today for the rest of us, we're heading to Nagala Rocks. I'm going to give that a go. So uh, not really sure how it's all going to go. It's raining a little bit, which would be all right. But we'll see how we go. And you can uh, come along for the ride. Rightio, we've just uh, decided to come up to Sandy Cape for the day. Went through South Nagala Rocks and it was actually quite easy this year. There's been a lot of rain and it's uh, compacted it pretty well. So, man, they're just flying through them like, well, might as well just keep going. So, we're just going to spend the afternoon here, chilling in the dunes, have a swim. Caden's going to have a bit of a flick, catch some dinner hopefully. And, uh, yeah, just chill out for the afternoon. So we haven't had the uh, best luck with weather. We've come back from Sandy Cape today and uh, a massive storm has rolled through on the east coast of Fraser. Uh, so just to give you an update, three of the boys' swags are currently broken and flooded. So we're uh, bunking up with each other, which is all right. Uh, and then we've had two gazebos Gonna have to be into the dump tomorrow, but that's all right. We got the music playing. We got Babes here making some dinner. What's on tonight, Babes? We've got chicken parmi wraps with bacon and chippies that are cooking in the air fryer. Rightio, last day. Back it up. Uh, it wasn't too bad last night. Got hit with a little bit of rain, but overall not too bad. So we're gonna pack up this morning. Um, go for a bit of regular and then maybe swim. But uh, 
Well, that is the end of Fraser for this time. Uh, really hope you've all enjoyed the, the time that you've seen. We've had a blast, I know we have. Uh, yeah, the weather wasn't the greatest ever, but you know, you get that on the big jobs. It's all good, we pushed past it. Uh, so yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the episode and we'll see you on the next one.